Earthquakes is probably the single biggest question we get. Um, and people don't realize that like earthquakes are primarily a surface phenomenon. They're like, like waves on the ocean. And if so, if you're in a tunnel, it's like being in a submarine in the ocean. There could be a hurricane on the surface, but in the submarine, everything is quiet and smooth. Um, and that's actually how it is for tunnels. And when there have been major earthquakes, um, such as the, there was a Mexico City earthquake, they used the tunnels for evacuation. Uh, the, because all the roads were, were, were disrupted. And, um, it wouldn't be possible to have a subway tunnel in LA, which a lot of people do not realize exists, but uh, there is a subway in LA. Uh, but it would not, if, if earthquakes were really were dangerous, there's no way that a subway in LA would be approved. Yeah. Okay, Japan is very seismically active and has uh, one of the best subways in the world. Yeah. Um, <laughs> sinkholes, uh, yeah, I think, would we agree that if, if you could actually detect any, with, with any instrument, detect that there's been a ground movement, we will take corrective action and then ask you for what that instrument was. <laughs> uh, because it's, it's really, you, there'll be no change in, no, no sinkholes, no nothing. You, you dig, dig the tunnel, you put in super strong reinforcing segments, um, and those maintain the, the diameter that you've, you've cut out of the ground, and there is no, there's no volume change. And so as a result, sinkholes are not a factor. Our, our tunnels are, we'll just basically go um, below the metro tunnels, so there will not be any, any interference with the LA subway system. Um, a lot of people uh, that are at the Boring Company are ex-SpaceX uh, or, or even current SpaceX people. We have a lot of SpaceX engineers um, that, that are uh, either kind of working at SpaceX and the Boring Company or full-time at the Boring Company. And um, so we, we get to um, use rocket technology to build tunnels or, um, and, and apply um, some pretty advanced techniques to, to create to tunnel technology, which hasn't generally gotten a lot of love. So we're, we're really um, taking world-class engineering talent, applying it to this problem, and seeing if we can make some headway.